ruins. What could you have to hide? What could the ocean have to hide? How long do you think that smoke signal on that drop's gonna last? And how quickly do you think that Gyarados is gonna kill us? <laughs> Questions, and many, that are gonna be answered today. Also, how did we miss that corpse? Hey everyone, welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles 3. In the last episode, we explored more of the high seas and did some trapeze work. <laughs> As you can probably tell, and since then we've got a little bit rusty. But in this episode though, we are going to be exploring more and hopefully getting more stuff done regarding ruins, exploration, and maybe even a quest or two. So, let's get into it right now and send off more people who try to be cool but then ended up the same place as us. Yeah. Rest in peace. You were not cool at all. And now gone from crustips and crabbles and cramets to now flammies. Been a while since we've seen flammies. Uh huh. And Golkins just spurting out of the ocean. You know, like normal seagulls do. Anyway, it's gonna skip by all this and avoid any of the Agnian troops. And by Agnian troops, I mean nothing. <laughs> Carl, did you drop supplies next to where all of the monsters are? No! Can I go to sworn I see him there? No, wait, they're gone now. <laughs> Some bugger picked them up. But anyway though, let's get to it. So now, where are you going next? The boat. <laughs> the boat. The boat that continues to elude us. I am really surprised that the boat in of itself is not a landmark. Yeah. The fact that it's not just, or just like a hot button. Like, hey, go back to boat. Yeah, like even in X, you had a button to return to scale. <laughs> uh huh. But then again, the X was menu centric. Mm hmm. I'm almost convinced that, that Xenoblade Chronicles X had more menu options than there were arts. Not saying something. <laughs> anyway, back to the boat, and then we can finally explore more and uh, see more. Get it because see. When my wife is silent, that's when you know she's not amused. Wow, that was finagling if I've ever seen it. <laughs> what in the actual hell? <laughs> Force it! It's like getting a warthog past the barricade in Halo. The game doesn't like me doing that. No, break <laughs> the sound barrier! Break it! <laughs> Who made these boat controls? <laughs> My Just god! Wiggling my way free. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, 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 can we get butter on the boat? <laughs> like, like, loosen it up and it slides through gaps. Thank you. <laughs> that was dumb. <laughs> that was dumb. <laughs> that was probably one of the most dumbest things I've ever seen a boat do. Yeah. Either way, let's just go on then to the landmass and just see what we can find in this area because this looks pretty goddamn epic and cool. We also get what looks like a camp nearby. Well, it's a Kevis camp. We have a rat nose to boot. Oh lord. Man, that is a risky camp, that is. Next to the seagull of death. <laughs> it's abandoned. I wonder why. <laughs> I think we got a leg it. Yep, leg it sounds good. 
Yo, I know you hate us right now, but could you shoot that bird down? Cheers. Right, so now we have, we've got quite the ways to explore on this island. Honestly surprised as we haven't got a landmark yet, so it gives me the impression we slightly glanced at this area once once before. I mean it says Lavi Sandbar. Yeah. I mean, there is sand. Seen the bar though. You itching to get wrecked. No, I'm not. I'm just itching to explore. I want to spelunk some ruins. Yes, I know in Xenoblade that that doesn't have the best track record. But still, what's life without a little adventure? Yeah. <laughs> if you stay safe and avoid all conflicts out of fear, then you know what? You're not really enjoying the game. Because who wants to hug walls in a JRPG? <laughs> like, that's no fun. X looking at you. <laughs> yep. I'm not saying that from any personal experience. It's like, hey, guess what? You are like what? A level 17 minion at this point? We this is a narrative path, a place in which you need to go down in order to explore, develop the story, and also level up and progress naturally. Guess what? We're gonna put level 50s in front of you. Have fun. <laughs> yeah, there's many things wrong. Many improvements. We're being targeted by Sagittarius. I mean, its aim is true. Which makes me glad that it never actually fired because I feel like you'd be dead right about now. I mean, if places like this existed in real life, would you honestly want to go look? Mm-hmm. Really? I'm the explorative type. <laughs> With islands like this? I'm surprised. Full of monsters, I mean. Oh, if it's full of monsters, then no. <laughs> okay, then they're about to say. It's like, it's like, yeah, I'm just seeing spiders, snakes, and everything under the sun. You were, until a monster got in your way. <laughs> Ooh, put you all the way back here? That's harsh. That's harsh, dude. Um. You got extremely lucky, you did. <laughs> I thought you would just kill yourself. I just had like a good 10 seconds of like, what? What are you doing? Like, you know what, Senna? I hate you now because you died. Prepare to die over and over and over again. Let's not finagle the boat. Let's just reverse at rapid speed. <laughs> Dude, if cars reverse at this speed, I'd probably reverse everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> Even on the motorway. I mean, what might help in your survival might actually be a case of you switching to a defendant and seeing how they have more HP. You're going after the supply drop? No. I was just going in a different way, hoping to find a landmark. <laughs> well, nope, too bad. I mean, to be fair, no matter which way you go, it looks ferocious. Yeah, I don't think they like you being here. No. <laughs> it's either that they're looking for a lot of stuff. Might have met old detectors. They're scanning for gold and booty. <laughs> it's always about the booty. <laughs> In the pirates? Yeah, sure. Even though it's been a while since we've gone on that lifestyle. It's 
Triton is no longer with us. I say, I say that as if he's dead. <laughs> yeah, that be it for me, I see. Corpse, will there be a surprise monster? Nope. <laughs> the corpse spawned in. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> I, guess I thought it was something coming out of the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Just scream, ah, magic man! <laughs> I don't suppose telling you the queen is dead will make you feel any better? Whoa, visitors. Nope, thought not. Enemy reinforcements. That's, that's like walking up to a... Well, we doing this? You suck. Don't touch me! That's not a. That's. Oh! <laughs> oh God! <laughs> He's pissed. The second that I escaped, it saved my life. Just that brief minute of me being out of the aggro. Oh God! He's coming back. This was another poor sod who was not able to escape the Vogels. <laughs> so we can sneak behind him and get the goods. What you got for me? Oh, good thing we found this. Is it? Because we still need to find a way to get the, the, to those ruins, wherever they be. Yeah, wherever they be. Wherever they be, yar. I guess what? You gotta try and walk past that man. That man bird bear thing. Yeah. <laughs> Yep, unsightly. Bits and slimy things gonna kick your ass if you're not be careful, but guess what? You work out with so jokes on him. You think you're all that, do ya? Okay, no, he isn't all that yet, but it's what he aspires to be. <laughs> I think that direction is heading back to the way you came, so. I know, I was just seeing if there was another way up. Uh, I think the only way you haven't tried is through all of the mech on death. Hey, he hit you with snake eyes and it did more than two damage. What the hell? <laughs> is that going back to the magical oh, man of corpse? Good. Yeah. Hello, big McConaughey thing, don't mind us. It's definitely not a reference to the big one on Fallen Arm. <laughs> no, not at all. One of the worst fights in the game. Yep. <laughs> Even worse than the big boy. Hopefully you know what I mean by the big boy. The big snowy blizzard boy. Yep. <laughs> that flies in the night. Oh, <laughs> oh no, a Pepito. Whatever will you do? This definitely is a spelunking on the beach. Yeah. Whoa! Get a load of the sky. Guys, get ready it's a thing. <laughs> it exists. Probably because it's in there's an aurora out right now. <laughs> Probably. Ooh, yeah, that looks good up there. 
Lovely. Behind Agnes Castle. Mm-hmm. Going on up! Something Nia would love. If she weren't a robot and dead. <laughs> Or just leg it. <laughs> no, thank you. Like what Lan says, I find that so funny. <laughs> what, leg it? Yeah. Yeah, well, it works. The best part of surviving is knowing when to leg it. Yeah. Or something along those lines. Right, that's a husk. Well, there's your fast travel point. The Sandbar Hulk. Oh my god. Does that mean there's alcohol in that Hulk? Bring it on. <laughs> I mean, you are roughly at around about the level, but it just all depends in how bad you want that fast travel point. Because there's a lot of things to kill. Yeah. And a lot of sinkholes to go down in. I think we'll hold off on that for now. Alright, discrepancy is a better part of Valor today. Because, my god, that's a minefield of landmarks. Yeah. Man, we've definitely gone onto the darker side of the beach. It's funny because it's night. <laughs> uh huh. That was the joke. I'll whack him good. No, you won't. You'll whack him good, as in like you'll whack the sand with your feet as you run. Type good. I care not for caterpillars. You can pile them on a list of things I do not give a toss about the, at this moment. <laughs> and let it be said, Tempapa will always be on the top up of that list. <laughs> well, hopefully we don't have to deal with Tempapa anymore. No, nope, hopefully not. But I do kind of like the notion of how, like, I was always curious, like, if you're a chef, how can you have a hammer? And then it turned out, he's not a chef, he's just a douchebag. People thought I was a good chef, and I just, I went with the lie. What you got for me? I'm going to guess that's going to be one of the pillar stones down there. So we've seen the first, we've seen the fourth. <laughs> Third pillar, so that means we're missing the second. Wouldn't shock me if they're the floating reef they're on us. gate things. Probably. I'll deal with you all at once. No, you won't, land. <laughs> you you'll think nothing of the sort. I'll take them on. <laughs> no, you won't. Not as lands and not as another character. It's an uphill battle, one you will not take part in right now. I don't want to slide, man. That's for not cool people. I'm walking up and down escalator. That's what makes me a badass. <laughs> Apparently. I don't think you've been that way yet, but do you have to go this... No, you've already been there, I think. If the map is anything to go by. But you can always try if you want. They're on 
What will it reveal? It will reveal Arachnos apparently spidering down from nowhere. Spidering down. <laughs> I mean, the, their webs will literally clung to nothing. That's oh, a bird of death. Yep. But that gives you another opportunity to go up. And you might have been able to find it. Hang on. Because you ain't been up that sand stream yet. Isn't that the one I just came... Oh, no. I think it does lead back to the same place, though. The Hulk. I think. Yes. Man, these ruins continue to elude us. How did we miss a massive piece of ruin? So this is where I kind of wish we had the drone shot from Xenoblade X. Yeah. Just launch it in the air and just see where you are. Are we really going to need a wide shot to figure out where the hell we need to go? I will say this though, I love the sand effects. Yeah. Very nice and very smooth. Very soft looking. Mm hmm. Wow, okay, this looks like a special area. <laughs> I like how you skirt around going, Do I want to jump down? Do I not <laughs> want to jump down? I don't know, man. Wow. wow. <laughs> Beacons of light everywhere. Jesus Christ, what kind of special mystical place did we find? This truly is a treasure trove of dreams. Hey, here's what we oh, need we need these things. Oh, so this wasn't a magical mystical shore of good things. Oh, do you mean it's to help someone get better? Oh, for God's sake. You mean this is for someone else's personal gain and not ours? Lame. <laughs> Sinner. That's the thing, for the stuff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Woohoo. We did the thing! <laughs> we did a thing, huh? We did. Insert Zell to jingle here. <laughs> we did the thing! I don't know why, just on first glance, I keep on thinking they're saying Rocket Dilly. <laughs> Rocket Dilly. Rocket Dilly. We're on the ocean with the Salt Lake Crocodilies. Crocodilies. <laughs> and the Alley Galleys. Alley Galleys. <laughs> oh, God. What is happening? We were just trying to find some ruins, and I was slowly losing our minds. <laughs> hey, don't you think and we haven't even drunk any seawater. <laughs> no. At least not yet. I mean, like, Gabe, we've got everything we need. We don't need those shiny beacons of false dreams here now. Looks like a pretty whoops. <laughs> How do you make a pretty whoops? A pretty whoops. If have a kid, that's how. <laughs> oh, it's pretty. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be one of the worst things to name a child. Whoops. Or, uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. 
your last name is going to be Take, and then your title will be Miss. <laughs> Hello, yes, Miss Steak, is it? Oh, 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 I see. Your parents did not like you. I'm very cruel, you know. Oh, thank God you and I, we were not going to have kids. Yeah. Man, what an elaborate island. Uh-huh. Still haven't found the ruins, though. <laughs> Just all of this for nothing. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, technically, you, you do have a landmark. Um, um, um. Okay, that shadow was short-lived. Just the one landmark for all of it. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I mean, I mean, we can try and explore a bit more, or would you want to call things there? Mm, try and explore a little bit more. Yeah, sure, no worries. <laughs> I'm still wondering what the hell those ruins are. Just you watch, those ruins are just gonna be a Kavasi base. Oh my god. But they were pretty high up and prominent, like... With the game being how it is, you can't just say, Hey, random ruins, nothing there. Um... <laughs> I don't think we're meant to see that. No. Shh, I'm meant to be a unique monster. Don't let them know I'm here. I mean, to be fair, that is normally how games load things in most games. Hmm. Yeah, 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 basically anything that, um, pretty much a lot of video games, if people need to hide stuff, but then load them in on, on a certain scenario, what they do is that they spawn the actual models and everything else far, far below uh, the game map. Mm -hmm. And when the click comes to load them in, it just, they get teleported upwards. Hmm. Yep, so every model is not like suddenly spawned in out of nowhere. Every hidden monster is hidden beneath the world map right now. That's your little tip for game development there. I like you got extra damage from falling. Yeah, I was hoping to avoid that, but... Well... The ruins are still out of reach. Yeah. But I think, though, next time, I might try my luck in trying to find them. Who knows? Might get some better luck. But until next time, guys, thank you all for watching. Beach exploration. Not much, but my god, it's been an adventure. Yeah. <laughs> so, next time, we'll be exploring this island a little bit more, as well as everything else around the sea, and seeing what goes from there. But of course, if you like the episode, then please be sure to like it. And if you want to follow us on this Xenoblade Chronicles free journey, then by all means, please subscribe to see more. And we'll see you next time. We will get to you. We will find you. <laughs> we will see what's in you. Just you watch. You're going to go up to it right now and you're going to find the way in. <laughs> Nope, that's for next time. See you next time, guys. The adventure awaits.